Our football today comes from the Emirates Stadium and it's a lovely evening for it. Martin Tyler here along with Alan Smith. Premier League football for you very shortly. It's Arsenal against Aston Villa. Yeah, thanks, Martin. Well, we've got a couple of teams here that their strengths are attacking, no doubt about it, so I'm sure they'll be going at each other very quickly. attending the Emirates Stadium. Enjoy the game. So Arsenal kicked off. Here's the Arsenal team. Three changes today. Ben Leno starts in goal. Rob Holding plays alongside David Luiz in the heart of the defence. Granit Xhaka starts alongside Lucas Torreira in midfield. And the main striker is Pierre-Emerick Aubameyang. Trying to find the opening, which would be so crucial. Must take the lead here! Oh, struck the post! And the referee lets them go on. Advantage played by him. McGinn. Space to try and hit it now. How oh, they open the scoring here. It's a good start. It's a flying start, really. Well, it looks simple, but this lad has got a great instinct of drifting into space, being in the right place at the right time. Let's see the replay now. Well, it's been tight before that goal, but now the manager, he's so pleased because I reckon he feels his team can go on and win this. So the first goal, it's 1-0. Chaka. Here's Torreira. Calabria. That's an unforced error, really, with the pass. Well, confirmation, as if it's needed, really. Everyone knows now, don't they? That the leak steered through. Opportunity now. Well, that's his second today. He's certainly got his shooting boots on. He is the kind of player that can hit his straps like this. Excellent day for him. He took it with greater plum. I'm sure getting the first goal gave him the confidence to grab the second chance here. And that's a goal well worth analysing again. Well, it's great when a plan comes together and the manager doubly delighted with the way his team are playing. Just widen the margin here to 2-0. Chaka. Granani Chaka. Here's Torreira. Great tackle. McGinn. Did you have anything like this in your career with safety being the, the bottom line? A few times at Leicester, actually, and it's such a nervy occasion when you know you have to get a result and it's all about whether you can keep your nerve. With his skill, here's a chance to have a run at goal and take the opposition on. McGinn, James Madison, Zamata. Just read the intentions of the opposition there to make the interception. Oh, chance! Top performance from a top team, and they've emphasised their superiority with the number of goals that they've scored. As for Aston Villa, that should really wrap it up. They played well today, 
and the latest goal confirms their victory, you would think. You don't always get what you deserve, but I think Villa have here. So they restart again, a bit demoralised now, I think, in a game like this. Jack Grealish. Nicola Pepe. Now Lucas Torreira. Bit of space to go forward into with the ball. Jaka to Abamayang. Thomas Socek. Granani Chaka. It's good work here in terms of possession. Can they find the final pass? No cross, good block. Nakamba. Again, Jack Grealish. He could cross it now. Oh, the keeper's done well to keep that one out. Thomas Socek. Now Lucas Torreira. Nicola Pepe. Difficult for the defender against the player who wants to take him on like this. Albama Yang. And he's seen the shot. No way through for the shot. Blocked. That was saved and the goalkeeper quite happy with a shot like that to deal with. Manuel Akanji. Madison. Akanji. Samata. James Madison. Well, they're getting the ball forward. They need to do that. Slip through. And he's put it in for the goal. And that's the third, the hat-trick. It's a day he'll never forget. Some players might switch off if they've scored a goal, even two goals in the game, but he's greedy for more, in the best way, I mean, and he's got a hat-trick. Yeah, he's been a danger from the start, his work rate, his, his runs off the ball, and been top class. One team really on their game today, the other very off-colour. Nakamba. Madison, James Madison, McGinn, trying to spot a potential ball to open them up, but they're keeping the ball well. It's Villa's corner. Corner's taken. Well, sometimes you just have to clear it like that. Safety first. Madison, and the keeper doing his job. Granani Chaka. Chaka. Pepe. Saw that coming and intercepted. Great tackling technique to win the ball cleanly. The fourth official has indicated three more minutes. Of three minutes of added time. Well, this is where the space is at the moment on the flanks. On the attack, with real gusto a moment or two ago, but it rather left them dismayed in the end. Well, here he goes. It's good to see a player do this. Pretty confident piece of defending in the circumstances. Squandering possession cheaply, Rit. The end of a good first half for them, but it. Well, we wonder if the second half's going to be like the first, one sided. McGinn. Excellent attacking play here. They could open up the opposition now. 
Nakamba. Excellent challenge. Chance for a break in numbers. Well, still the attack is on, but not really a counter-attack now. Towards Albamaya. On the cross, blocked well by the defender. Well, they'll get a corner out of this because of the deflection. He's doing more, isn't he, than just keeping them ticking over in midfield. He's, he's running the show. He's been the uh, conductor to the orchestra, hasn't he? Look at those touches. That assist he provided really was a beauty. Fitzel. That's good passing, probing. And he gets it back. Looking for goal now. Good stop by the goalkeeper. The keeper's given the ball away. He's done well to keep that out. Will they get the cross in from this short corner? Wants to have a go. Good block. Well, a real treat in store for you. Coverage on EA Sports of the Premier League fixture. Arsenal, they'll be facing Burnley. Yeah, I've had a lot of supporters get excited about it, and I am as well. David Luiz. Aston Villa's next game, Alan, what about that? They're playing Leicester City in their next match. And judging on the form so far, I can't see much to split them. Nicola Pepe. And off he goes with some options. And the goalkeeper's got to collect the ball for a goal kick. Well, we're two-thirds of the way through the 90 minutes. Half an hour to go. Thomas Socek. Socek. Axel Witzel. Well, when they do say, and you've been... They could be in, behind the back line. And the cross goes towards the far post. Well, sometimes you just have to clear it like that. Safety first. James Madison. McGinn. No, it's offside. Well, this is a real shock. You can see it in the faces of the players, and you can hear it in the lack of noise, if you like, from the supporters. Well, those fans can't even be bothered to give their players any stick at the moment. They're just stunned into silence. Here's Christian Pavon. Obama Yang. Fitzel. That's a free kick awarded here. And the manager, Alan, is making this change here. Substitution will take place. Pleasure to be here to see it, Martin. And uh, he'll be grabbing that match ball at the end of this match. Stopping the pass, getting through with a good piece of anticipation. And shoots! Wonderful save. Had to really reach out for that. Corner played into the middle. Dealt with the danger. Pepe. Socek. It's a good hit. And he's reached it, he's kept it out again. How frustrating for the opposition. It must be one of those days where they feel they're just not going to score. Grealish. Trying to steer it through. Cleared the ball. And Arsenal are going to bring on some fresh legs. McGinn. Madison. Nakamba. James Madison. Good vision here. And there it is! That's an awesome goal, 
supremely cool to master the chip. Well, I've been talking about this one for weeks to come. Absolute beauty. Different angle on it here. Well, I know this manager's been working hard on the training ground on a certain shape, and boy, is it getting results out there. I have to say, it's so one-sided today, but all credit to the team for uh, racking up the goals. Great interception. Well, this could be an opportunity in behind the defence. Well, it's come to nothing in the end. Oh, it's a tremendous goal. We can't really blame the keeper. He did his job to initially save that shot, but that's when he needs some help. And the striker was on hand to finish. That's the word on the goal scorer. You have to get there to get the chance. And credit him for that. Well, I think the keeper, you know, he's entitled to ask why his defenders didn't react as quickly as the goal scorer. He'd done his bit, he'd made the initial save. Well, it's not easy to find the spirit here that they're going to need in these circumstances as they kick off again. Pavon. It's 82 minutes played now. Encouraging play from this team now. Keeping the ball. Tierney. A right, chance to whip it in here. James Madison. Marvellous Nakamba. Break quickly when they get possession. Opposition slow to get back, so possibilities still on the counter-attack. Well read at a key time for the team here. Nicola Pepe. Really not at it today, Arsenal. Surprising. Surprising, and I think uh, for the following match, there'll be several changes after this. Real chance. Great move, great goal. Well, they've got a goal, and that will mean a bit to the players, particularly the scorer and maybe the manager of the team. I think that's what you call a consolation goal, Martin. Nothing more than that. They've got the better of him at last. Not an easy thing to do. I feel a bit sorry for the keeper. He's kept everything else out. Well, he's been doing his bit. I think it's his defenders that need looking at. Left him exposed. The manager's going to bring on a fresh player now. 6-1 the score. There will be a minimum of three The scorer minutes. will be very proud of this, but it won't mean too much in terms of the result, just a, a personal triumph for him. I think so, the opposition really had stopped playing because they know that they've won the game. Axel Witzel. Now Lucas Torreira. Socek. That's another turnover here. It's finished now with the final whistle. What a brilliant performance from this fella. We came into this match absolutely full of confidence, and he's just continued in the same vein. What a hat-trick, what a performance in this win.